The Namibian House is solid. The this will be the first the time President Hage Gainkop is accounting for government programs that were carried out away. under his administration. And as the president declared 2016 as the year of implementation, the nation's expectations are high. But what is the real state of the nation? It's generally anxiety and expectations. That's, that's where our people are. Expecting um, results from their various issues that they are having. And, and that makes um, us a bit anxious. For political commentator Ndumba Kamanya, the Harambe Prosperity Plan, the question of addressing poverty and economic inequality, peace and stability will be the key focus in the president's speech. He is excited that for the first time there is a presidential plan that will be presented to address the socio-economic issues in the country. I'm hoping that he will come up with very specific details in terms of how he's going to uh, implement it, uh, what specific steps are going to be taken, who's going to do what and when. Housing crisis, economic growth and president's stance on issues around gender-based violence are some of the matters that former parliamentarian Rosa Namises wants a clear direction from the head of state. I'm expecting him to become more practical in terms of the things that needs to be done for us. Now we are in the second year of his service. We want the three years to really bring about the change. And members of the opposition parties who will be posing questions to the president are advised against political point scoring. But that does not mean that they should not be uh, critical because uh, what we need from the opposition uh, party is that critical engagement to make sure that uh, the government is doing the right thing. They have to ask tough questions, not only ask questions, but they should also come up with alternatives. The question is, will there be any policy movements or tangible action, or will it just be another speech? The president surely knows that he will be judged based on what is going to happen after the speech. Tonatani Shidudu, NBC News, Vinduk.